Hello, this is Hilda Franks, and we have made it into Tier 3. Tier 1 and 2 support strategies and interventions have not worked. So what is next? While Tier 1 is universal and Tier 2 is strategic, Tier 3 is looked at as being highly individualized. Remember, Tier 1 and Tier 2 supports and interventions do not stop once the student enters Tier 3. All too often, a new strategy or new intervention is tried and dismissed immediately as not working. It will not work unless given a fair chance to work. It usually takes two to three weeks of consistent implementation to know if it's effective or not. Remember, behavior almost always gets worse before it gets better. The technical term for this is extinction burst. All strategies, supports, and interventions are intensified in Tier 3. Parents or guardians should be highly involved in the decision making at this point. If a student is in Tier 3 of Behavior RTI, the campus should conduct an informal FBA. No parent consent is required for an informal FBA. Formal FBAs are only done once a student is referred for special education and then parents consent is required. At this point in the behavior RTI process, the school should have a lot of data and should be able to show that they have tried every avenue of helping the child manage his or her behavior. Thinking outside the box, changing schedules, getting very creative in helping the child manage his or her behavior. Tier 3 of behavior RTI or academic RTI does not automatically mean special education. Students should remain in Tier 3 for at least four to six weeks and show no progress before a special education referral is even considered. The next three slides present the special ed referral process. Remember though, even when a child enters special education R504, Tier 1, Tier 2, and Tier 3 supports and interventions continue. They do not stop at the special ed door. Please continue on and read the next two slides for yourself. Thank you. For many people, one of the most frustrating aspects of life is not being able to understand other people's behavior. We cannot fix or cure a child with behavioral issues. Our goal for all students in Behavior RTI is to manage and help each student using positive behavior support strategies and interventions designed to maximize each student's success. To review Tier 1, Universal, Tier 2, strategic, and Tier 3, highly individualized. Remember, Tier 1, Tier 2, and Tier 3 strategies and interventions do not stop if a child enters special education. Thank you and good luck on the following review.